Yo guys, Shemmy here with another Shem tutorial. Uh, this time it will be a short tutorial, but a very important one. Um, I want to talk about panning. Panning is really important because, uh, let's say for instance, you have your kick in the middle and you want to introduce a clap and a snare together. Um, if you don't pen them, uh, you will only put the sounds in the middle. Uh, you only get rumble in the middle and you cannot really identify the, the sounds where they are and if you pen the sounds, let's say the clap to the right 50% and your snare to the left 50%, you'll get a way more spacey track and everything, every sound has its own space in the mix. So you get a re way more clearer mix. Um, I want to demonstrate this in my DAW. Um, here I have my clap and this one is my snare. Um, I hope you can he hear very clearly what happens when they... Um, when they get introduced in the track um, and at this point this is my kick and at some point here my clip and my snare come together with with the kick and so let's listen and i hope you can hear it very clearly i have to put on my mic by the way <laughs> So, I hope you can really hear what I'm doing here and why I do it. Um, yeah, try to experiment with it a little bit. Um, don't just pen everything everywhere because then you can get the same problem. Like if you pen three or four sounds at the same point in the mix in the left, you get the same problem as the kick has with everything on it. So try to listen and hear where, where you want to put the sounds. And I hope this will help and give you a, a little bit better mix and uh, let me know uh, what you can do with it and send me some stuff uh, if you tried this and if it helped you. So, uh, share me out.